Hey, what's up everyone? Today I'm diving into a topic that's often overlooked but super important male fertility and age. We all know about the biological clock for women, but what about men? Can guys really father children at any age? Let's break it down. First off, when we hear about men in their 60s or older becoming dads, it's easy to think male fertility doesn't have an expiration date, but that's actually a bit of a misconception. Just like women, men also experience a decline in fertility as they age. So yes, men do have a biological clock. Now, at what age are men most fertile? While it's tough to pinpoint an exact number, most research suggests that male fertility starts to decline around age 35 and becomes more noticeable after 40. According to the CDC, significant age-related fertility declines after 40. Some studies even show that fertility rates drop from 52% in men under 35 to just 25% in men over 35. So if you're in your early 30s, you're probably in your prime fertility window. You might be wondering, do men ever stop producing sperm? Technically, no. Men continue to produce sperm throughout their lives, but the quality of that sperm takes a hit as you get older. Starting around age 35, you might notice a decline in sperm count, shape and movement. That's according to the World Health Organization's benchmarks for healthy sperm. So why does age impact male fertility? It comes down to four main factors, sperm count, motility, morphology and DNA fragmentation. All of these parameters can worsen with age, affecting your chances of conceiving and having a healthy pregnancy. For example, men over 35 see a 52% decline in fertility rates and are 12.5 times more likely to take over two years to conceive compared to men under 25. There's also an increased risk of miscarriage and adverse pregnancy outcomes as paternal age rises. But don't worry, it's not all doom and gloom. There are ways to improve your sperm health as you age. Lifestyle changes like eating a nutrient-rich diet, exercising regularly, quitting smoking and cutting down on alcohol can make a big difference. These changes won't stop aging, but they can help improve your overall sperm health. And if you're really serious about protecting your fertility, consider freezing your sperm. Banking your sperm now, while it's at its healthiest, can give you more options down the line. So there you have it, folks. Age does matter when it comes to male fertility, but there are steps you can take to improve and protect your sperm health. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching.